I'm Natasha Murnia from Animal Health Ireland and we've been running, in partnership with Meat Industry Ireland, the Beef Health Check programme since 2016. The programme monitors liver fluke, liver abscesses and pneumonia at slaughter in any of the participating abattoirs across Ireland and reports these findings directly back to farmers. One of the main outcomes of the programme so far was a study done by Rebecca Carroll in 2019. She was looking at the cost to Irish farmers of liver fluke. In steers, she found that if animals were infected with liver fluke at slaughter, and this could be either having liver fluke damage or live parasites on the livers, she found that these animals were likely to be 36 kilograms lighter at, at a slaughter age of 819 days. This translates to an estimated cost of 77 euros per infected animal, depending on the price of beef. To achieve the same average slaughter weight, animals would have to be kept longer on farm with increased costs and associated greenhouse gas emissions. The data from the program is being used to look at trends in Ireland. For example, the northwest counties are much more likely to have liver fluke. County level maps are available on the AHI website, and these are updated every three months. But these are general trends, and there are differences even between neighbouring farms, with one farm being infected with fluke and the neighbour not. So it's important to look at the data on your own farm. Rebecca Carroll, who helped set up the Beef Health Check programme, will now explain more. Beef Health Check is an Animal Health Ireland-led programme developed in collaboration with Meat Industry Ireland. It is developing tools to assist farmers and their veterinary practitioners to control losses due to liver fluke and pneumonia through the capture, analysis and reporting of abattoir data from post-mortem meat inspection. Every week cattle are being slaughtered in meat factories all across Ireland. Important information on the health of these cattle and their herdmates can be obtained from the post-mortem meat inspection carried out by temporary veterinary inspectors or TVIs on every animal slaughtered in Irish meat factories. Touchscreen technology allows TVIs to record their findings on liver and lung pathology. The vet can input information on livers damaged by fluke or liver abscesses and pneumonia damaged lungs into a computer on the line. A paper summary of these findings for each batch of animals presented to a factory is sent directly to the farmer as the beef health check report. The report contains information on the liver fluke status of these animals at slaughter and whether the animals were affected by liver abscesses or pneumonia. The next phase of development has been to make the Beef Health Check information available online on the ICBF website. The new Beef Health Check dashboard provides farmers with more tools to search and analyse the information for their farms at herd level. The information accumulates over time and can provide farmers with an overview of what's happening on their farms. Farmers are encouraged to share this online information with their veterinary practitioner. AHI has produced a booklet to help farmers access, interpret and share the Beef Health Check information. This step-by-step -step guide to viewing Beef Health Check data on ICBF is available on the Animal Health Ireland website. Farmers and their veterinary practitioners can use the Beef Health Check report and online herd level information to implement and monitor herd health plans including parasite control programs, pneumonia control programs, and elements of nutritional management. Herd health planning promotes the responsible use of antihelmintex and antibiotics and improves animal health outcomes on farms. The summary graph allows farmers to instantly see any problems found in their cattle's livers or lungs at slaughter. The graphs are interactive and farmers can click on a bar to see more detail on a group of animals. The fluke graph shows liver fluke scores on a month-by-month -month basis for a farm. Farmers can see if slaughtered cattle are affected by fluke, the proportion affected and the presence of live fluke potentially indicating absent, inadequate or inappropriate dosing. Armed with information from the Beef Health Check programme and following discussion between the farmer and their veterinary practitioners, farmers can implement dosing, vaccination or other herd health programmes on their farms. Information from the Beef Health Check programme is also contributing to the development by ICBF of breeding indices that incorporate health and disease data. This will help farmers to breed healthier cattle that have more resistance to disease in the future. The Beef Health Check programme aims to improve animal health and welfare outcomes on farms by providing good quality information to farmers and their veterinary practitioners. As the information accumulates, AHI will use the data to look at regional and national trends. It will be possible to issue alerts when the incidence of live fluke in slaughtered cattle increases, allowing farmers to make more informed decisions about dosing their cattle. All this information will be communicated back to the agricultural community 
aiming to make farming in Ireland more sustainable and profitable.